All right, Shalom. This is Brother Kashukwala coming back at you with another lesson, giving all glory, honor, and praises to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem Hakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone to rule and teach well. Peace, love, salutation to the elect 144 first fruit. All right. So uh, today I'm just coming with a lesson. Just uh, it will be a swift one. Just wanted to uh, um, talk about. You know, these events that are going on right now, the stage is being set. That's it. You know, there's a whole bunch of simulations that are going on. And what a way to start off 2021. I will say it didn't start off as big as a bang as 2020 with the Soleimani death. But I'll take it. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? It's just uh, the same. It's the it's the rollover from 2020. Simple. Yeah, the same things happening with Black Lives Matter doing all those stupid little riots, looking like hooligans and monkeys out there, swinging from fucking branches and branches and shit. All right, burning cop cars and looting. You know, Black Lives Matter showed they ass in 2020. Well, guess what? The Trump supporters are they want to do the same thing. They trying to they trying to turn up too. All right, ended up having four people dead. <clears throat> ended up having four people dead. Uh, yesterday at this quote unquote um rush of the capital all right it says capital secured after assault from trump supporters <laughs> right you know um uh, i watched a little bit of that uh you know i watched a little bit of um trump speech i'm telling you man this dude trump it was like it was like stand up comedy he was just sitting there just dissing people. Uh <laughs> he was dissing people. He was uh you know, making false allegations, things of that nature, and it was just funny. It was it was comical. And then ultimately, what did he do? He instigated a riot. Okay. Alright. He uh was his words were a catalyst to, you know, his words were a catalyst to people wanting to go haywire, you could say. Okay? So I'm going to read a little bit of this. It says, at least four people are dead after supporters of Donald uh, President Trump stormed the U.S. Capitol in Washington, D.C. Uh, on Wednesday, uh, forcing Congress to evacuate as lawmakers counted electoral votes. And another thing that's kind of funny to me is the fact that in the same speech that Trump made yesterday, he said that they've bumped up the, um, what is it? They bumped up the spending budget for military, increasing the military, opening a space force. You see what I'm saying? All these security uh, measure, measures and these these uh, <laughs> quote unquote Trump supporters, his little militia army that he produced, right? Infiltrated the damn Congress or the Capitol in two hours. Where's where's the uh, National Guard? Where's the uh, army or any? Where's the boots on ground? That's what I want to know. They ain't nowhere to be found. You see what I'm saying? They ain't nowhere to be found. So I wanted to get one quick script to it. And I might try to pull up. Um, I might try to pull up. Uh, <clears throat> a little bit of that speech that Trump was, you know, saying last night. Man, it was, he didn't care no more. When you, when you when you really hear what he was saying, he didn't care. He didn't care about his tone of voice. He didn't care about his word choice. Nothing. This is Second Thessalonians 2 and 3. It says, let no man deceive you by any means. And, hey, don't let this damn devil deceive you with what's going on, man. We see what's going on. A little demonstration yesterday. Rushing the capital, things of that nature. All right, now there are some videos out there. People really did die. But that was on their own accord, especially that one woman. She tried. 
You try to breach a federal building. I'm pretty sure you're told to stop or they will shoot. This dumbass tries to hop up over the, the window or wall because there is videos out of it, her getting shot. And she got shot. You can't sit here and talk about how, oh, she was innocent. She got No. Y'all should not have been in the Capitol in the first place. People are bound to get hurt. Especially when it's some type of, uh, um, you know, political movement or what or what you could say. All right. Again, it says, let no man deceive you by any means. For that day shall not come except there be a falling away first. And that man of sin be revealed. Right. So don't let yourself be deceived from this trickster. He reminds me of the, the character in the Marvel movie, Loki. He was like a shape shapeshifter. He knew how to imitate other people and trick you and deceive you, thinking that that person may be that person, but it's actually Loki. All right? It's a deceiver, which is the devil. All right? It says in that man of sin be revealed, and his little diabolical plans are being revealed to the world. It's getting sloppy. And if you're being deceived in this in this matter, you're not your your eyes aren't open. Us you know us men who are in the you know following you how about Shimia Shai we're sitting back and we're watching everything unravel. Things are going according to plan, according to the scripts, according to prophecy. We're just watching it play out at the moment. 2021 has it's a good start to this. <laughs> I like it. It says. Uh, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. Right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to find this this Trump uh, speech real quick and play a little clip of it. Because you can see, man, you can see what's going on right now. Like. Let's see here. Give me one moment. See if I can find it. Yeah, let's see one second. Off. So they out here partying. All right, there you go. So he's rallying people up, okay? I'm going to find one specific part, though. You hear him? They'd be hell all over the country. But just remember this. You're stronger. You're smarter. You've got more going than anybody. And they try and demean everybody having to do with us. And you're the real people. You're the people that built this nation. You're not the people that tore down our nation. So pretty much, you know, I just want to get a little snippet. And y'all can uh, go back and watch it. Um, y'all can go back and watch it, but pretty much during that speech, he was telling 
literally telling him to go to the Capitol, go march to the Capitol. He literally used the word bullshit in his speech, which is, you know, you're the president. You're supposed to have an upright demeanor about yourself. Uh, even even his uh, fellow colleagues are turning against him, you could say. Um, Mike Pence did. So this, you know, Esau, he just up to something. He's just playing a game right now. You, he's probably putting on this front because he's doing something over in the Middle East that he doesn't want people aware of. That's why, you know, continue to look at your geopolitical news as well, what's going over there. Can't forget about the Brexit that just happened not too long ago. That made, They made that official, uh, official that the, uh, the Great Britain has officially left the EU. You see? So things are happening. I didn't give a, a damn about some pasty Edomites running a, a, a storm in the capital, man. What's really going on? You see? So, you know, didn't want to make this lesson too long or, you know, too long when it just want to get that one quick precept. Just don't be deceived with the actions of this damn devil right now. The stage is being set. So with that, I want to give all glory, honor, and praises to Yahweh by Shemi Shai by Shemachakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. Peace, love, salutation to the elect, 144 First Fruit. Until the next time, Shalom.